Leticia Ordaz, and here's a look at our big stories that we're following for you today. No purple beam in Sacramento sky. The Kings face the Golden State Warriors in San Francisco yesterday after a nail biting game. The team lost the game by only one point. The final score was 125 to 126. That leaves the series now tied as the Kings prepare to head back to the Golden One Center for game five on Wednesday night. Some of California's top advocates for seniors will be rallying at state capitol through Wednesday. They will be brainstorming ideas to find answers to increase to help seniors who are suffering from malnutrition. They also are calling for an expansion of nutrition programs for older adults. Advocates will be at the state capitol starting at 10 this morning. Parts of Interstate 80 and Nyack were closed over the weekend after a tractor trailer caught fire. The California Highway Patrol released this video showing smoke coming from the truck. They say this happened near the secret town exit. The agency is reminding tractor trailers to use the brake inspection area in Nyack and not to ride your brakes. Instead, they recommend using the engine brake brake to slow your vehicle down as they come down the mountain. Let's go now to Tamara to check on our forecast. Yeah, heading out that door to a pretty mild kickoff to your Monday. We have temperatures that are both in the upper 50s in the foothills and even in the valley spots. Some of you like Sacramento waking up to 57 degrees right now. 54 in Yuba City. One of the cooler spots is Fairfield and Stockton. You're at 51 degrees and right now it's 32 degrees. So right at that sweet spot of the freezing point in the Truckee Basin. As we go through the day today, we will see temperatures get closer to 60 by 9 a.m. We're into those upper 60s by mid morning and today's going to come in just a hair down temperature wise looking for highs in the lower 80s. Leticia, thank you so much, Tamara. That's a look at what we're following for you this morning on KCRA 3.